Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss about the transient model in Odoo 16. Transient model is a model in which the data will be deleted periodically. Since the data will always be deleted, it is not recommended to use this model to store the real data. In Odoo, the transient model is mainly used for visa creation where the data need not to be stored permanently. So I, I'll show you an example of the wizards here. That is, if you go to the CRM module, you have the example for the wizard. And he, this is the wizard, as you can see here in the UI. And you can see the multiple fields that is defined inside the U, uh, wizard. And here, these data is not necessary to be stored permanently in the database. So we use for the creation of visa the transient model so the data will be periodically vacuumed so uh, I'll just go to the apps here and here you can see the custom app that I've created that is company management and I'll be showing you how to create a visa here and going to the PY page here this is the visa directory so I have created a directory under my custom module that is the company management and inside the directory I have given the init file where I have given the imports that is the py page that I have created as you can see that I have created a cancel.py page here so here basically I have created a wizard to cancel so this is just a demo wizard here and after giving the wizard I have given the class, I have defined the class here I have given the name of the wizard that is the cancel.wizard and I have given the field here as you can see I have defined the field inside the wizard so as you can see that when I have defined the class I have given the model as transient model as you can see here that I have given the model as transient be model because I don't want my fields inside this, uh, the wizard to be stored in the database so as you have given the transient model the values will be periodically vacuumed from the database so it won't be stored in the database for permanently and as you can go to the securities here if i go to the securities you can see that i have given the access right for the wizard here so i have given the name of the model here that is cancel wizard that i have defined inside the py page of my wizard so after giving it as the transient model as i have created a new wizard here and i have given the transient model so let me run it and after running it I'll just upgrade it and after upgrading it you can just enable the debugging mode here so after enabling the debugging mode you can go to the settings and in the technicals you can go to the models here you have the option to see all the models that you have created in the Odoo 16 here and you can search for the model that I have created that is cancel.wizard and you can see here there is a session where it denotes whether the model that I have created is a transient model or not so as we have given in the backend here that is the wizard model to be the transient model you can see that the boolean field is checked because we have defined the model to be as a transient model. So this is how you create a transient model in Odoo 16. So the transient model basically doesn't store the values in the database. So in case you need the data not to be stored in the database and only for the UI purpose like you have seen in the CRM module that I've shown you about the wizard here. So as you can see the wizard here. So these field values wouldn't be stored. 
in the database. That's all for today. Thank you.